Thank you so much. Thank you. Bonjour. Merci. Je t'aime. I, I just like have to say hi to the Asian people. To... <laughs> it's going well. I want to give you some American news. Now, this is exciting. Um, the very second Asian American family television show ever, fresh off the boat, got renewed for a second season. So I'm very proud. Very excited about it. So very, very good. We did a good job. We, we, did, we did excellent. It's, it's good because it's, um, it's that I had the very first Asian American family television show 21 years ago. Yeah. And I fucked it up so badly. They had to wait for an entire generation of Asian Americans to be born and grow up with no memory of me whatsoever. I have a very Korean name. My Korean name is Moran. Moran! Moran! That's my mother calling me. Moran! <laughs> That's a legit Korean name. I mean, it really is. It's actually the name of Kim Jong-il's production company. <laughs> so, you don't want to face off with me as a Korean. I'm fucking really Korean. I really am Korean. But I have met people more Asian than me. I met a girl, her name was <laughs> <laughs> I was like, oh, that's pretty. <laughs> Do you spell that with a C or K or? It's just like it sounds. <laughs> you can call me Jay. I feel, I mean, I feel like uh, Fresh Off the Boat is a point of pride. You know, I'm, I'm proud of it, but the, the people at the network didn't like the name Fresh Off the Boat. They thought it was racist. Of course, it was all white people. It's so cute when they uh, get offended on our behalf. <laughs> Isn't that the best? It's like, they're like, whoa, whoa, okay, all right, yeah. Okay, all right, <laughs> all right, all right. Okay, all right, okay. That's a bit much, all right, okay. I think that white people like to tell Asian people how to feel about race because they're too scared to tell black people. <laughs> you know, we have less melanin, probably not gonna protest. <laughs> Asian women are beautiful. I think we have a lot of power. I do, I do believe that. I feel like I might be a little bit past my sell-by date, but I still have. I think if there was an Asian woman army with big boobs, we could solve all the problems in the Middle East because we can make Jews do anything. <laughs> if it had been us instead of Moses, it would not have taken 40 years to get out of the desert. But sometimes I think, you know, we as Asian women don't even understand how beautiful we are. We have a sort of inferiority complex to white people. I mean, I've seen that happen when you see a really beautiful Asian woman and she's with the, the most fucked up bus of face white man, you know, just, I'm just like, bitch, are your eyes that small? deviated from the path of Asian-ness, of Korean-ness. Um, I went into comedy. I went, I went into comedy in a, in a way that was um, very sort of different, and I went into it very young. I told my mother when I was 14 I wanted to be a comedian, and she said, oh, maybe it's better if you just die. But she, she, she's into it now. She's very proud. You know, she looks at my work and I, I get to show her new things like YouTube, get her to try to understand um, technology and everything. And I showed her a video of Miley Cyrus twerking. <laughs> and all she said was, oh, she's shaking out all of her luck.
But my mother gets very angry with me because I have a lot of tattoos, and I know this, uh, don't be alarmed, I'll show you, I have a lot, I have a lot of tattoos. I, um, because I'm trying to avoid plastic surgery. <laughs> All my friends are getting plastic surgery. I don't want to do that, but I want something. You know, because I was, a, I, I'm like that, that, like I was a fat girl and a really fat kid, fat teenager, and I would always hang out with really skinny, beautiful friends, and we'd all go shopping, and they'd buy beautiful clothes, and I, I would get a mug. Because <laughs> I wanted something. So this is my son, I get tattooed. I'm just gonna keep getting tattooed so nobody even notices that I have wrinkles. They'll just be like, oh, where's that turtle going? <laughs> so I don't have a lot of time. I'm, I'm just gonna show you the extents. This'll be a good uh, kind of a closer. I've gained a little bit of weight. I'm sorry about this, but uh, my underwear is very small. I have an enormous bush, so watch your eyes. <laughs> Watch your eyes, it just sticks out. It's gonna come out like, I have, I, it's not a 70s bush, it's an 1870s bush. <laughs> you know, it's like my pussy's making cough drops. All right, so I'll show you, uh, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna do it like this. I'll show you what's happening. All right, don't, don't be upset. I'm sorry. Okay, can you, can you, I don't know if you can see the detail Okay, I'm apologizing to the Asian people first, because I know this is, I'm really dishonoring our ancestors by doing this, but, you know, we fucking built the railroad, so whatever. This is, this is more important. Now, I don't know if you can see their actual faces, um, and I told the artist, I said, uh, don't put the, the nose too close to my hole, okay? Because my body's not a joke. I feel like Sia right now. I, I, I really... I'm going to swing from the chandelier. All right. So I... I want you to... Uh, okay, th I got the faces there uh, specifically so I could do this. Can you see what's happening? Do you see it looks like they're talking to each other? They're laughing. They're laughing. These are the real housewives of my ass. Thank you very much. Good night.